The Attorney General Hihara Karuki has filed a notice of appeal against the High Court judgment that declared the Building Bridges Initiative BBI bill unconstitutional. Meanwhile, a caucus bus section of members of the County Assembly has termed the High Court judgment nullifying the BBI initiative as a threat to sovereign power of the people, national unity and devolution. Daniel Karuki reports. In an unexpected event in the journey to amend the constitution following the engine failure the BBA train experienced after a five-judge bench last week declared the Building Bridges Initiative BBI illegal, null and void. Attorney General Kihara Karioki says he is dissatisfied with the entire decision of the courts and wants implementation of the judgment suspended pending determination of his appeal at the appellate court. In a fresh application, Kennedy Ogeto, the Solicitor General, says they have already filed a notice of appeal at the appellate court and at the same time seeking to have the Constitutional and Human Rights Division at the High Court suspend implementation of the orders it issued on Thursday last week. The bench issued a permanent injunction restraining the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission from conducting a referendum. Meanwhile, a section of MCAs have faulted the High Court ruling that declared the Building Bridges Initiative BBI null and void. It is the common Mwanainchi and the middle class that suffers more in unstable and fragile democracy, democracies, not the elite. Fast forward, on, 24, uh, on 24th May 2018, His Excellency the President, Exercising his constitutional duty in Article 132, Section 2. The MCA is saying that if the judgment is adopted by the Court of Appeal, it will set a trend whereby Kenyans cannot amend the constitution in order to address social and economical issues, but will instead resort to anarchy and violence. The BBI 1 and 2 committees are unconstitutional and illegal. This takes away the express constitutional duty of the president in Article 132 to promote and enhance national unity and therefore Kenyans have to resort to whatever means available to them from experience, hook or crook to resolve their issues. MCA sentiments coming a day after ODM leader and co-principal of the BBI initiative, ODM leader Rela Odinga, urged for calm and restraint amid escalating personal attacks on judges who issued the judgment on Thursday. All eyes will now be glued to the courts this week as those courting the BBA process promise to remain adamant until the Constitutional Amendment Bill 2020 is taken to the people for a referendum bearing the question on whom between the executive and judiciary will have a stronger blow. Daryl Karuki for Switch TV, Nairobi County.